Hi, Senator. How are you, man? So the president came out today and said that if it's determined that Brett Kavanaugh lied during the hearings, that that's disqualifying. That sure. That's if it's shown, uh, and they can corroborate, that there was a lie in his testimony, uh, then, yeah, that's Is there a chance that the FBI at the end of this week comes to you all and, or comes to the president and says, we, we need more time? The president was pretty clear in saying, I want the FBI to do with whoever's credible. People can say anything sure. they want to say during these types of sure. really highly charged. But we, we can't forget about the victims either. There are these, you know, I'm hearing from people I never heard, never thought of. I start thinking about my sisters and my daughters and my, and my granddaughters. You can't not know this has been traumatic for anybody who's been through this type of uh, sexual abuse. And you, you never can forget about them. Now, on the other hand, still yet, there's a lot of claims that are made on people that just aren't true. So shouldn't a person have a right to clear their name too? And I think that's where I want to have that balance. Will you declare what your intentions are once you hear the information? I hope, unless it's just rapid succession, that I would have time to declare before I go in and vote. I'm going to do what, what I know in my heart that I can go home and, 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 and explain it. I always said, if I can go home, look at West Virginia and I and explain it, I'm okay.